Worms campaign missions. This is number 29, Crafty Cavern Keepers. And this Allow is the penultimate mission. <laughs> On our way to the prime objective of killing all worms, we also have to poison all enemies. worms on the map. It's going to be a little tricky. We also have to collect 10 crates. We've collected two so far. I have to store all my three. movie awards in these big and crates. We're obviously using our ninja rope a lot. Watch me lift this. Number four. And what I want to do is just just get a small hit. Just a fire punch. Go ahead. Oh, first I'm gonna dismantle all the uh, sheep on a rope because I don't need it. Dead or alive, you're coming with me. Then we're gonna fire punch this worm. Just take the first off. So we collected four crates during that go turn. I'm going to put a crate counter on the screen for that right now. Big booming. Victory is looming. There we go. I'm in control of the battlefield. Don't you worry. So you can see dotted around the map in various locations there are crafting materials. You are weak. This will allow us Let's to fight. craft various poison Let's see what you make of this. weapons. So there's a gas grenade we've just crafted. So there's down? number five crate. I'm not hanging around. And number six crate. You move with the finesse of a fifty stone canary. I don't know why you're sitting there looking quite so contrary. I'm just going to place this grenade about a worm's width you away from this guy. Hopefully that will blow him down. Just hey, towards that, that other worm. That will help us later on. Obviously we can poison them both at the same time. The big bad city is bowing Just down using to one Excuse weapon. I can smell smoke, I can feel the heat. There must be another rapper around here that I just gotta meet. I'm gonna put you in your place. Not that smug look from your face. So we're hoping that those two no worms to look on in such stay dismay. Even the relatively still close have together. Day. So we can, like I said, poison them both at the same time, time using whatever we're gonna use. We're going to just check in on the wind direction at the moment. So the direction of the wind is a left a little. I'm going to put my ninja rope up there for escape. And just drop my gas grenade so the wind blows it in the correct direction for this worm. I also craft a poison dynamite. There's the gas grenade. Just escape into safety. You can see that I've poisoned... My first worm. You better not have ruined my shoes, because then you really are gonna lose. And also killed him. Big booming! Victory is looming! So the third secondary objective that you need to complete for this is to defeat a worm <laughs> using the barbecued sheep. And the barbecued sheep just is a normal sheep just with fire. Here is just pure lame. And you can see during that well, turn I that crafted a jetpack just in case. So back with our second worm. I am if you notice the wind isn't in an optimum... I'm not hanging around. I mean there is no wind currently so it's not very useful to go and drop a gas grenade on the two worms below so we're just going to make our way through to the right hand side of the map and then remembering to retreat because they are going to blow up that health crate hey fool i'm over I'm here i wouldn't mind so much but you weren't even near gas grenade looks like we got a new Super important, to really to uh, to every turn to Craft a gas grenade or a um, 
poison dynamite. I'll serve you a dish of fresh cooked beef. Have a little chef on the top of my game. There goes the health crate, like I said. No need to look on in such dismay. Even the best rappers still have an off day. Allow me to break the ice. So back with our first worm. The Worminator. We're going to get as far across the map as we can. Uh, oh. Oh, that was close. Slight screw up there on my part. Looks like we got a new weapon to use. Pack your things and get ready so to lose. You do have to be real good with the ninja ropes on this level. Just crafting a worm, select. Because I know my second worm at the moment is relatively safe. However, my first worm isn't so much. That's a perfect example there, I'm already getting aimed at. said it was guaranteed to never miss. Party. So I'm going to switch worm. Try and get again as far Throw across to this. the right hand side of the map as I can. I see you had a goal with the trigger, but you gotta think bigger. So this is a tricky maneuver. Just drop in onto that. To store all my movie awards and these big crates. And then again across. We've only got ten seconds left. Just right. popping up and getting crate number eight. Enough talk. And I, I can't really do anything else, so I'm just going to leave that. Get my crafting on. Going to craft. Like we got a new weapon to use. What I want to craft is the super flatulent sheep. I'm going to do the barbecue sheep. I can make turn. all kinds of grisly endings for you. The super flatulent sheep obviously is a super sheep that farts and that poisons everything around it, so hey, that's gonna brother. be super I reckon useful. You, with those fresh beats, you gotta be part of my crew. Huh. In the later stages of this mission. Check out my profile and understand. Moves like this give me the upper hand. No need to look on in such dismay. Even the best rappers still have an off day. Time to die. Okay, so with our second worm now, because they haven't actually blown a hole through, I'm just going to create a little path for myself. I'm doing it in this way. It just ensures that there's a couple of bits of land between myself and any weapons that are going to so come my way. I'm yeah, just checking out the crafting materials, what I've got going on. Still need a few more to create that super flatulent sheep. Just a little bit of slowdown there on that turn. Well, dang, the what I've noticed during this game is when the AI is thinking really hard, the game slows down seriously. So just collecting the health crate. I'm not sure if that counts as a crate, so I'm not actually going to count it. I see you had a goal with the trigger, but you gotta think bigger. Notice the the wind is going towards the left. I need it going towards the right if I want to kill that worm below me with poison. Consider that a so I'm just gonna waste my turn there. Is 
See if I if I put the grenade like on the right hand side of him. The poison smoke would have gone above his head. So you need to do it slightly below. Let's see what you make of this. And in the direction that the wind is going. Obviously he's going to try and bazooka me. Oh, thankfully he's going to send you back from whence you came. Your star here is just your lane. Brilliant. No need to look on in such dismay. Even the best rappers still have an off day. Let's party. I am yeah. the Ruminator. Pop over with my ninja rope. Who wrote me into this? Because what I want to do here is get rid of three bones. So I'm just collecting this yeah, ninth crate. First of all, setting off the mine, obviously. And I'm just going to fire punch this worm. Oh, no, I thought he'd go off the edge there, but he didn't. So best to get close to him because With then anyone wanting to aim at you won't shoot at you for fear of killing their own guy. Big booming, victory is looming. Still unable to make the weapons that I need. You can see there's a diner just on the right hand side of the screen like there. There's crates in that space. Well, dang, the player and that told me this said it was guaranteed to, to never right. miss. You don't actually need any of them. It's showtime. Now we've got our wing going in the correct direction to be able to. Get rid of this one below us. Hey there, fool! What you looking at? Want me to introduce you to my baseball so bat? Gonna place. I don't like you telling me what I can do. What I can't do. Just so it blows the smoke <laughs> to the left this time. <clears throat> yeah, you can see we've poisoned him enough, but not killed him enough. That's not good. The big bad city is bowing down to us. Excuse my excitement, but I gotta cuss. Check out my profile and understand. Move like this, give me the upper hand. No need to look on in such dismay. Even the best rappers still have an off day. Let's so, back with our second worm, and we will. Actually, will we be able to fire punch him away? Possibly not. You lack discipline. Who wrote me into this? All I'm going to do is leave him in the poison dynamite. And he's going in the right direction. So we've got him poisoned. And taking him down to 8 health, so that's good enough. Big booming! Victory is looming! I do like these hip hop worms. I think possibly my favourite one is Piddly D. Just there at the bottom. Well, dang, the player that 
and also they said make, it was guaranteed they make to mention never of the inflatable scouser at some point, which is clearly awesome. So, crate number 10. I'm just going to get rid of this worm. Obviously, our fire punches we've got unlimited. And now I'll be able to craft my super flatulent sheep. That better not leave a scar, or your battle ain't gonna go far. So we've got all ten crates. I can get rid of that counter now. The big bad city is bowing down to us. Excuse my excitement, but I gotta cuss. Gonna craft another craft gas grenade. Oh, this guy's gonna get me with a bazooka. Gonna send you back there once you came. Your style here is just pure lame. Some nice luck on my side for not cover. knocking me into the water. You gave me no choice, but I had to oust you. I send your regards to the inflatable scout. So I'm still not safe with, with my second worm, although it's not imperative that I keep everybody alive. Big booming. Victory is looming. The real important thing is not killing any worms before you poison them. Hopefully that's only taken me down to 48. To Look who's talking. So what I want to do is switch worms to I'm not that hanging worm around. and just get somewhere relatively safe to use my sheep. I told you I'd make a fool of you. You can see the fart cloud. I'm just going to get these three worms because you can see it's going in that right hand direction. I'm just poisoning the three of them and exploding on the last one. Ouch! I bang my head! I hope I don't lose my beads as that's something I dread! So that just leaves three worms left to poison. And again, it's all about which worms you go for is all about which way the wind is blowing in on a certain turn. I'll serve you a dish of fresh cooked meat. I'm a lyrical chef on the top of my game. No need to look on in such dismay. Even the best rappers still have an off day. I don't want to have to drag your butt to the ramp, police, so you gotta be careful where you aim that Okay, so... It's at this point where I can use my jetpack. And I think... Possibly the best thing I can do is get in the mech. And because that wind again is blowing to the left-hand side, I can just pop a... little gas grenade next to this worm. You tell me what I can do, what I can't do. I'll poison him and then I can escape in the mech again. Just escaping over to the right hand side. Oh, so close to knocking him into the water then. Yet another gas grenade because I can. You 
You blew my cover. Hey, I'm on your team. Great health wise. You can see now the, the, the wind is, is, is blowing towards the left hand side quite you. vigorously, so I know that this would be the perfect opportunity to go and poison the two worms below my starting position. So I'm just trying to make my way across there as I'm fast as I around. can. Being as smart as I can with the ninja rope. Yeah, so I'm, I've made it within 30 seconds or so. So I can just place that gas grenade. This should Hurry. poison both of them. I need to kill them particularly. Yeah, that's everyone. So that's everyone on the map poisoned now. And a nice kill on this side as well. Hey, what was that for? Keep that up and I'm gonna have to show you the door. So all the that's left to be done now to is excuse my to kill the remaining that. worms and make sure I kill one of them with the barbecue sheep. I uh, played this mission obviously numerous times just to perfect it, just to get the method down. I don't want to have to drag your butt to the say bomb, a police. lot of times. So you be you aim that I actually managed. I actually went all the way through to uh, sudden death. I'm just setting up the mine. Allow me to break the ice. Fire. My situation dire. And of course, I can kill any one of these now. Just taking my pick. Yeah, so two or three times I went through to sudden death, won it. But I wanted to be able to show you a video where I did it within the 20 minutes. So I found that this method is probably the best. It's it really it's the it's the getting the super flatulent sheep and being able to poison three, maybe even four in a turn. It all Stop depends it. on how you are able to group them together after certain hits. You blew my cover. etc. This type of thing. I don't want to have to drag your butt to the ram police, so you gotta be careful where you aim that piece. So we're running low on health with both of our worms now. Gonna send my barbecue sheep down. Make sure I kill. Even though he's only got three health. You know, I'm just making sure that I get that barbecue sheep kill. So we've got our barbecue sheep kill. We have poisoned every worm on the map. We've collected our ten crates, as denoted by my awesome crate counter. So now just these three final worms to kill. And just about three minutes, thirty seconds to do it in as well. Again, we're freaking the AI out by being so close to well, dang, his the player that sold me this said it was but he doesn't want to shoot in our direction. Allow me to break the ice. So I'm just going to grab the meth walker. Get it out of the way. Just to get there, another shotgun fire punch though. And just jump, I'm going to jump into the meth walker again. For safety. However, with only 25 health. I don't think he's going to survive this next turn. Hey. 
just a bazooka shot. Should kill a mech. Hey, I'm on your team. Don't kill the mech. Who wrote me into this? Oh dear. Oh, I can't believe I survived. I'm not hanging around. That's pure luck. Oh dear. Now Ouch. we're having problems. I bang my head. I hope I don't lose my beats as that's something I dread. I got what I need. I ain't no super sheep in my flock. I leave. Gonna send you back from whence you came. Your style here is just pure lame. Hey, don't look no. at me and laugh and scoff. Even the pros still think they're right. I've been smart. Up. I would have crafted a shotgun there in that in that turn. Unfortunately, I'm not. Can't get up there, so I'm gonna try the the old rebound trick. Oh, that's a nice first time. I might not be looking so dapper. The reason but I've come up live. this way we is because I can get rid of lazy. And just get into the magnet zone. Place is on fire. My Again, I'm hoping that Fiddly D or Piddly D doesn't have a Uzi or a shotgun. Because he'll take me out. So, final AI turn. What's his choice? Oh my god, he skips his go. What is this? Amateur hour? So 45 seconds left on the clock. Parachuting down. And after this we will have killed all worms. We poisoned everybody on the map. We collected 10 crates. And got a kill. With the barbecue hey, sheep. Keep that up and I'm gonna have to show you the door. Super long mission. Glad you stayed with me through the whole video. Hope it helped you a little. And I'll see you in number 30 for the final mission.